Here we have a member of the Rosaceae family. It's in the genus Amelanchia. And for this course, we're just going to look at the genus of Amelanchia. So remember, that would be SPP. This is serviceberry, or juneberry, or shadbush. It goes by lots of different names, depending maybe on the region that you're in or the specific species that you're referring to. Let's take a look at some of the general characteristics of Amelanchia. Bark of serviceberry is smooth and gray, and really this is what it's going to look like for the bulk of the life of serviceberry. Older or very large stems might start to develop a bit of texture, but generally these will be fairly smooth and gray throughout. Here is a twig with some of the foliage, and you can clearly see that it is alternately arranged. Here you can see a leaf of a service berry, and while they might differ in size and shape a little bit, this is fairly typical. Dark green top, slightly lighter on the underside with a prominent central midrib, and then veins that come out and sort of arc as they near the top. The edge you can see is finely toothed, that often referred to as cereulate for the margin. Here we can see the terminal bud. It's pointed. The bud scales are often reddish in color. And around the edge of the bud scales, you might see small white hairs or a slight white color. The fruit are right here, and you can see that they're starting to turn red. They come out a green initially, turn red to maybe a, a deep purple in color. These are edible, they're fairly sweet, can be made into jams and all sorts of things. Birds also love them, so this is a great wildlife tree. One of the common names, Juneberry, is because these fruits are some of the first to come out, and they're usually ripe or ready by June or end of June, depending on the season. The flowers of the Juneberry that give rise to the fruit are typically nice white flowers that appear fairly early in the season. Here you can see a fuller extent, and these are really more shrubs typical than trees, although you can have a single-stemmed serviceberry or juneberry. These happen to be multi-stemmed and pruned a little bit more like trees, but you could have a much shorter statured shrub. It's going to depend on the variety or exact species and then how you maintain it.